Um, yep. Oh. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna all look for the secret exit while we're at it. Yeah, that'll be that'll be a good, good idea. Let me see my eyebrows too. Oh, yeah, wow. I, yeah, I I've been pretty much dreading doing 3D SLPs because I, I always knew from the start it was gonna be a nightmare to do this stuff. Um. But yeah. Let's see. Ah, damn it. Wiki, don't let me down. Let you down? It's in the first level. You had you had to start from going from the first level. How do I? Oh, oh, I see it. Oh, I like it. <sighs> okay. I see why they want you to be mini, at least. The Mario reaches the two... Yeah, well, what's the one does the level head to the first level? Alright. I... I feel like I've already gotten a secret exit in there, haven't I? No, you got it in the ghost house. Hmm. Mario reaches the two question mark blocks before the area with the snake blocks above the pipes. Mario needs to hit the right question mark block to make it fly. Then stand on top of the block until it flies forward. Okay. And after that, you can probably know what to do from there. Okay, just go through this. Oh boy, I'm mini. Yeah. Hey, somebody get me up! But I will never understand why they, like, refuse to give you an actual indicator where a secret exit is. Because I swear to god, like, well, yeah, they used to do that. They used to, you know, where they used to do that, Mario World. Yeah, I don't know why they just don't do that anymore. Cause they're secret. Yeah, well, I, 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 I like to know where I'm searching. Wait, what now? He's trying to. He's like, secret why don't they exit. tell you? Why don't they give you a hint to where the secret exits are? Yeah, that you just. Doesn't count as hold your hands and Harry. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Hit the right. Let's see. Is it here? No. Okay. okay what am I looking for? A question. Uh, when you hit a when you hit a question mark block, um, the one on the right will start flying. I think it's this oh, one. Oh. Okay. Once you do, stand on top of it. Oh, I see. Don't move. Oh. <laughs> you know, in any other game, that would be an instant death. <laughs> <laughs> that was unique. Hey, uh, applause <laughs> for cleverness. I just like how it just goes, zoom! Yeah. From here, it should be a straight shot to the cannon. Yes. Mario has a cannon. <laughs> Somewhere. Yeah. I keep leaving them all over the place. <laughs> I wonder if this is gonna send us like to World Star or like the Bowser World. Well, we'll find out, I guess. Cause I feel no, I I feel like it has to be like um about like World Six or something because I know I'm pretty pretty sure the final level the like the castle level in World Star is like Dry Bowser, which assumes you beat regular Bowser first. Well, we'll see what happens. Because that'll be funny if you fight Dry Bowser first and just screw the whole game up. Okay, so... Oh, 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 oh. Ah! 
<laughs> Invisible blocks, why? I like how you got screwed over by a star. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're actually playing the Lost Levels edition of New Super Mario Bros. <laughs> 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 Kaiser Hack, Kaiser Hack. God, have you... Man. <laughs> About what? Kaiser is funny. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> It's funny if you're not playing. Uh, I it's misery. I mean, Kaiser, Kaiser Mario 64 is just hilariously bad, honestly. I, li uh, I like how my favorite part is how it starts. Yeah. Well, I've I've seen like full playthroughs of that, and it's just kind of badly designed. And I'm not even just talking like Kaiser. I'm j I kind of just mean in general, and I mean I mean no disrespect to the. The person who made it, but <laughs> I'm just, yeah, I'm just being honest. Um, I thought that was the exit pull for a second. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when when your like idea to make die die docks harder is to make like a giant line of sharks, and then that's it. <laughs> I don't think that's a really well made hack. I'm sorry. Throw it. Yeah, I see what to do. I just need to like. Make no. sure you don't get hit by the buzzy beetle. Yeah. Do I need to throw it from up here, maybe? Let's find out. No. Well, there's another one. So you got another shot. Yeah. Hello? That works. I'll uh, take it. Uh, we take it. We take those. I don't... Wait, yeah. wait, wait. Hit that, wait. Go back and hit that buzzy beetle. I mean... Throw it in between. Coinage. Coins. <laughs> yeah, boy. Good. Good. All right. Um, Why is it? He paid for it. But yeah. No. Have you guys seen uh, the Kaizo Galaxy One and Two? Because like the stuff in those in those ones are like absurd. <laughs> is that uh, also bad? It's <laughs> no. It, it's it's not. No, uh, okay, Ka Kaizo 64 is just bad. Uh, Kaizo Galaxy 1 and 2 is just ludicrously, like, it it's actually Kaizo difficult. And the stuff I've seen is just ridiculous. <laughs> um, oh. Okay, you I'll give you a few examples. You okay, so you know Hurry Scurry Galaxy in, in the first game, right? I think so. Um, you okay, so you know how the music platforms are usually, like, on the platforms? They're off the platform, aren't they? Um, yeah, the what you have to do is like you have to like awkwardly. Um, <laughs> how do you even spin jump? Yeah, you have to like awkwardly spin jump because the the note the music notes are like underneath the platforms. Um, is so that you, way out? Yeah, <laughs> that's messed up. Um, I mean, wow, it sounds it sounds dumb. Yeah, I think. I mean, the, what they did with Mega Leg is more tedious than anything, but they made it so. It's three three rows of bombs uh, of things, and you could only and you have to get make sure it goes over the thing. <laughs> <laughs> now, what they do is like you can only get use the bullet bills that come from like under it or whatever, and you have to like like uh, have it follow you throughout the whole thing. There's no bullet bills on the top of Mega Leg. So you basically have to meticulously like inch it around along. Yeah, which just sounds tedious more than anything. Um... <laughs> getting a headache just think about it. Yeah. Is that punch club? Yeah. Yeah, we, we've done these before. Positive. Um... Oh. Yeah. All the one-ups. I see. Yeah. Probably the easiest... No, it, it is the easiest one-up <laughs> challenge in... In these games, I don't even remember what the other ones are. <laughs> uh, the balloon cannon shoots from New Mario Wii. Oh yeah, yeah, right, right. The one, yeah, the one where they just throw out like mushrooms and Bowser and Bowser um sp 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 uh, belt uh balloons. Yeah, what is uh you? That's that. Oh, right. And then DS, I don't remember. Um, but yeah, I was saying, um, yeah, other thing, like, okay, 
You know. Oh, oh, I see what you have to do here. Yeah. Uh, so you know, in in Galaxy One, Go uh, Gobblegut is the first like grand star boss and all that. Uh, oh, Galaxy Two. Um. Uh, I think it's throw another bomb on it. Yeah. Um. What they did is um, for the comet, they um. Okay, there's a few things that they did. They made it a daredevil. Oh um, they made it um, so you only have a, like one minute, and they also made it fiery gobblegut. <laughs> and it's and it, it just it's just a nightmare. Like, and this is world one. <laughs> Sounds charming. Yeah. I wonder if something's in there. Yes. I don't want to hit the checkpoint first. Oh. Oh. Well, this is... Something's going wrong! Follow it, keep following it. Well, I... done goofed. You're gonna assume it had something there. Yeah... Like, oh, well, time to kill yourself. I'm gonna try flying up... Oh. I think that just <laughs> got... I think that... Yeah, I was gonna say, I think... I think it was just guiding me for some... Uh, gu guiding me to something, so... <laughs> yeah. That feels more lucky than anything. Yeah, no, it was, th what I was gonna do um, was, uh, like, wait. use... Wait, what the heck? The blue pipe? But check, karate each pipe. But... Can't just be coins. Can't believe it. Really? Oh. Well, fine, where does it lead us? But yeah, no. Uh, yeah, my. Oh, yeah, I, I, was, I, I was gonna fly fly up to the yeah. platforms or whatever. Um, like that was a complete accident. Well, let's just keep moving back. Let's just keep moving forward. Maybe there's something. Feels like the Goomba like touched the tip of your tail, and that's how you lost the power up. Yeah. Oh, I touched your toenails. I guess you gotta die. <laughs> yeah. I love, no, my favorite is like I remember watching Jaden's animation on the Ka oh. on a Ka on a Kaizo hack. <laughs> yeah. First of all, it's oh, um, and like there were cats for some reason. Yeah. But the funny part is, is she it, it just tapped her it just tapped her Mario avatar in the back and she just collapsed. <laughs> yeah. It's it's funny when you like get squished in like the Galaxy games, um, and it's just like your pinky finger that got crushed and you just. Die. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh, I see. <laughs> I see Lemmy's ball. Balls. I'm surprised I didn't hit you, to be honest. I mean, well, the balls don't, like, hurt you. I'm still surprised I didn't hurt you. Well, I think that's consistent with how it was in New Mario Wii. Yeah. Yeah. They they just bounce you back. Speaking of which, I think the 3DS was a missed opportunity to have a remake of Ball Street E titled Ball Street E 3D. Oh yeah, isn't that the N64 game? Yes, that is on the N64. Yeah. I think. Can I see? I think it's the same developers that did was it like Extreme G. Stream G was that a sports game? No, that was a racing game. There's a, a few sequels, I think. Um, I don't, I'm is, pretty, it, is it is, is the conveyor belt moving faster? I don't know, but yeah, he's dead. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I guess they tried with that one, I guess. But yeah, the for my for my remember most of the Kooplings, if not all of them, just have. Less interesting versions of their Mario Wii fights. Um, if, yeah, <laughs> there's not much to say beyond that, really. That was L Lemmy we just fought. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know. I only know this because my brother has the Bowser Jr. amiibo and he made it Lemmy and he called it Lemmy Winks. Hmm. Okay. So let's go back and do the cannon. I believe it. I believe that's after. I believe he named it after a thing. South Park. South Park. Nice. It was a rat. <laughs> I don't watch South Park. Hmm. I said I don't know. I don't watch South Park. <laughs> Literally, the only South Park I know is the video games. <laughs> 
Which are at oh god. Which are actually oh. Good. oh my god. <laughs> yeah. This is just a 2D mock speed section. Pretty much. Um yeah, the these are like I like how the cannons are like the one part of the game that's like really hard, and everything else is like super lax. Yeah. The heck? You should probably get a raccoon leaf just to give yourself some leeway. Yeah, I mean, that's the easy way out. <laughs> that's the save time for your audience way out. Mm. I mean, I'll give it an honest effort, but. I'm gonna send this to Rob, he's gonna love this. Yeah. Oh, what hey. the? That was nonsensical. You jumped on them. Yeah. It's an unrelated Reddit post. Yeah, because the thing with these stages is that if you don't have a raccoon uh, leaf, um, you pretty much have to be, um, like, <laughs> whatchamacallit, just super, it, super accurate. I mean, you kind of have to be regardless, it's... Because like, you need to know, like, what kind of jumps you need to take, and like, um, all that, yeah, it's... That would... It's weirdly trial and error for a game like this. <clears throat> Alright, time to pick it up! Yeah, and I can't change power yeah. ups. So, okay. At least it wasn't very long. But I swear, like, those feel like they're in a different game. Oh, we're, yeah, we're already at World 6. Wait, <laughs> no, we, Cloud Car has a mind of its own. Yeah. Yeah, like, what the heck? Peach actually wants to go to Bowser. <laughs> this is what's happening. So that's what the canon of Mario is. Yeah. And he plays a mean game of Parcheesi. So we're finally going to World 2. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the desert. Yeah. Which is also going to be our last roll for the session, since Harry Probably. we're only supposed to be for an hour. No. Yay. Yeah. In fact, how long have you recording? <laughs> uh, forty-five minutes. Um, I mean, some of, that, some of that, some of that, um, like isn't even accurate because of the mess up. Mm. Sack. Coming. I'm, I can hear. I, I don't have any audio, obviously, but I can just hear the piranha plants chomping and making their silly noises when they die. Like, gosh, that is that's like peak nostalgia for me from the DS era. Hmm. Yeah, that is a thing. Yep. These, these guys knew how to design Mario levels. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, playing this is like... I don't know, the, the game's fine. Uh, I... I wouldn't say... It, it doesn't... It definitely isn't anything special, but... Um... It's fine. <laughs> Sorry, I had to fix the door. I... I mean, the, um, like, collecting coins is, like, something that never really gets old in these games, so I, the, um, core concept is solid. Can you even get up there? Yep, it's fine. Easy money. Yes, that's it. Money, money, money! Yeah. This is the best Wario game we got on the 3DS. <laughs> the best Wario Land game we got in the 3DS. Yeah, because I mean, I was, like, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, have you not played Wario World Gold? I mean, I, I actually have not, but I, I wasn't going to diss it. <laughs> the only, ex okay, the, uh, <laughs> the only ex Wario World Gold, Charles Martin A gets to actually voice act. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. No money. <laughs> I need, I need a big cash. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The, okay. My only experiences with uh, Wario, the Wario World series, is um. I played a bit well, of just because of Martin A gets to keep me. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I played a bit of smooth moves, I think, at someone's house like years ago. 
Um, uh, I smooth moves is one of my favorites. Yeah, I always had like smooth moves is one of the like favorite ones. Um, I'm trying to think. I think besides that, uh, the only one other one I played is what is it? The DSiWare one, like Snap. Yeah. No, not not that one. Uh, like Sn WarioWare Snapped or something. Um, That's not uh, DSiWare. Oh, uh, w whatever it was, like the. Um, the one way to use the camera, um, like... That's snapped. Snapped, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... It's, it exists. <laughs> uh, the most fun I've had, I, I've had doing that was, um, not even really <laughs> playing the game. It's more so just trying my best to, like, awkwardly make it so the, uh, camera, like... Like, I, I tried tricking the game to make it register, like, a plushies, like hands or something to try and make it play like that and it barely ever works <laughs> but i think you like why you wear gold because it's basically a best of compilation game yeah yeah i i have the one on the switch but i haven't played that one i, I don't know oh, how I, I don't have that but i want it I, are you, you're talking about a get together yeah uh, i don't know if that one's any good but xavier told me it's pretty good mm. Like, I've seen, I, like, I've seen a video of it, like... My like, favorite part about every, my favorite part about every WarioWare game is that all of them have a song. Hmm. Yeah. But I like how, uh, what's it, the, what... Get It Together has, like, a character select thing, and it looks like it came right out of Smash Ultimate. Yeah, right? So where the heck is this star coin at? This is a very weird level. Yeah. Non-linearity. What is this, Wario Land? Yeah. If it was Wario Land, then we couldn't die. <laughs> was it like Wario's uh, doesn't feel like dying or something? No, oh. I think that's that's Wario World. Oh yeah. Wah, 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 wah. No, my. I, I, was, I was joking with this about, because when we were playing uh, Mario Party with uh, Nick the other day, uh, Nick Xavier and Hub, but it's just like, mm -hmm. I had to explain to him that, like, Wario's not fat, that ain't, that's not necessarily fat, that's all muscle. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're, you're not wrong. I mean, it's just like, seriously, like, do you see how strong he is? Yeah, no, no Wario is ridiculously strong. <laughs> uh, like, it's like, there's no way that's just pure fat. No. Uh, yeah, uh, Shake It and Wario World are like the two examples that really show, like, how strong he is. Yeah. Because, like, he just. Man. <laughs> he just throws people, like, enemies and pillars and everything around, like, they're nothing. And they can bust when they, when they collide with the walls, even. Yeah. It's pretty good. Alright, so where was the first coin? Uh. Try just look around. Oh. Did I... I don't think I did... Yeah, okay. Oh, that was easy. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore, ignore that. Hey, the boomerang bows don't matter. Yeah. Oh. Honestly... <laughs> yeah, I mean, that makes sense. I wouldn't be able to get up there otherwise. Um... I thought you would just thought, have it just high enough of a jump, but I guess not. No. Okay. Eh. And well, we get to live. Never mind. Yeah. So we got three different, like, um, I guess, I don't know, Hammer Brother variants. Uh, well, yeah, we got the fire. Yeah. And there's a Boomerang Brother right here. Yeah. Yeah, so the Hammer Brother, the Boomerang Brother, and the Sumo Brother, and you said there was a Fire Brother? Yeah. Fine, this, I don't think we'll be this level. Mm. No, no, there was. There was. It was. It was the one that got turned into the one that was throwing the gold. Oh yeah. Oh well, I guess I was looking off screen at that time. So they got the. I guess they got the big four, so to speak. Mm hmm. Meanwhile, that pokey died. Yeah. You know, um, these blocks in the wall giving me kind of anxiety. A little bit. Um. They. They. They know where you live. <laughs> I, I knew it! Yeah. Ooh. For the Buzzy Beetle. Wait, uh... Form in between those two. I guess. 
coins. That should have just been like the Nintendo Direct. Stand on that. Yeah. We stand on that. We, we went for that. Yeah. Um. Sure. Oh. Yeah, I can't remember. I think. I don't think you could. Could you spin Pokies with the cape in Mario World? I don't think you could. I uh, think. Pokies. Um. I don't know. No, actually. I know you can spin jump on like. Nearly anything. Yeah, I don't mean spin jump. That's why people got upset at Mario Maker when they when you couldn't do that. Yeah. Oh, I see. Um. All right. I see. Or right, have we a good aim? <laughs> <laughs> or I can just. Or I can just die. <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't remember what- I'm pretty sure, like... What was it, like... I swear, like, nearly en every enemy dies from the spit cape spin, right? I don't know. Okay. Nice. <laughs> the lack of having coins is a uh, kind of oh good. Is that the first one? Oh, okay. Yeah, I always get paranoid when like the first star coin is like really late into the level. Damn it. One day he just put a big star coin like like right like literally right in front of the, the flagpole. <laughs> just make you sweat. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Just yeah. have have all the star coins at the very end just to uh, make you panic and just troll you. Guys, it's, not, it's weird not hearing a coin timer. Mm. It's the we're we're playing on the mode that kids who have to sneak their 3ds, sneak their 3ds, turn their 3ds on like at midnight to keep their parents asleep. Yeah. Ah, so, um, ah, so I know gamers. So, oh, there we gamers. go. Yeah, gamers. Uh, wait, uh, I was gonna say you head back. Or, oh wait, what's up there? Yeah, I'm trying to get the P switch. Okay. There was more switch. I saw a bunch of coins pointing up. Like right there. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Okay. I think you messed up. Why? There's those coins that they were pointing up. I mean, is there a way up there? I don't know how I, don't I know. how I would Wait, mess it up because there's like. Nothing changed. Get that power block from below? No, because I need... I mean, that's what I was trying to do earlier, but... Maybe if I can just, like, jump from here? Yeah. Ah. Camera? <clears throat> I mean, this is different. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oh. There we go. Oh. Okay, I- there's definitely something there. That was- that was easy. Okay. I don't know that if I- I don't know if I- Shit right there. I don't know if I'd necessarily call that easy. <laughs> but, you know. I bet that we got all of them in one run. Oh, god damn it. A friend of mine invited me for Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I keep passing out these jumps. I am so glad I don't have the audio to hear the stress inducing less than 100 seconds music version of the music. Seconds! Yeah, I'm probably gonna hear that in a yeah. second. Time. You can't. Oh my god. 
Is there a pipe? That oh. Yeah. Is that it? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's a pipe that shoots you up. Well, you you already knew that for your hindsight. That's the best kind of sight, Harry. Hindsight. Is, <laughs> is, is you want to be a jackass? Hey. <laughs> I just thought, like, I saw that just like because we saw it in a later level, earlier level, and I was like, maybe there's a pipe that just shoots you up. Well, yeah, but like. Man. Save your progress? No. So I just figured that that was a secret, so. Mm hmm. Wee! Uh, you know what? Anything? This actually has not been a half bad world too, because it's kind of just not really been a desert world at all. Um, it's just been a, it's been a desert, a cave, and like there's this weird sky ruin. Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah, I'll give it props for that. It basically feels like something new. Ah. Ah. <laughs> uh. Feels like a Mario World level. Yeah. Ah. I think. Yeah, I feel like if um, the series were the series was uh, more consistently like this, um, it would have. Oh. Oh. Well. Nice. Uh, oh. Uh, I see. Well. Well. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it, I feel like it would have a much uh, nicer. Um, like opinion, I guess. Um, so we talked about this multiple times, about our same level tropes and feel, the games feel the same and whatever. Um, regardless of like your what your stance is on that, um, like, I feel like the general opinion would be a lot nicer to these games if, if it, they did do stuff like this more often. Um, Cause this is this is cool. I like this. Hmm. Yeah. I feel like I messed up. Well, let's we'll find out. Yep, you did. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, something. You, you're probably. You're, 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 I think you're jumping a little late there. Yeah. No, I'm definitely jumping late, but I, I also just missed the other coin. Yeah, I definitely. But when we're done with this whole series, I do want to um, have like a overall final thoughts about this whole like sub series, I guess. Because uh, I'm at this point, I don't know if they're gonna like do another one of these. I feel like I, I mean they they could always. There's nothing stopping them from like eventually making another one, but I feel like at this point it's been so long since like Mario and Luigi U that. Um, I feel like they kind of need to do something. How the hell would you do that? Grab the Koopa, maybe, and then throw oh, it from up there. Oh, right, okay, I'm not, okay. By the time the next one comes out, New Mario U will be almost as old as Mario Land 2 was when New Mario 1 came out, so... Yeah, boy. yeah. This throwback will be the come. then there will be a throwback to this throwback. Oh, What's Jesus. old is new, yeah. again. They def they need to like freshen it up though I think because I don't I don't want them to just come back with a another NSMB game and it's like barely any different. Um, I don't know. Maybe that's a bit too harsh, but I don't. Thing is, I like usually Mario games. Um, are pretty good. Oh my god. Um, I was looking at something in the mic. The more you curse this game, the more it'll curse you back. Um, nice. Oh, you got in a lot of coins. Yeah, no, I, I just saw a light turn on and I got distracted. Um, yeah, well, yeah. I come for Romani. <laughs> what? <laughs> Majora's Mask joke. 
one day. Um, and now you have another way to play it, so. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I started a playthrough of that game months ago, and then I just never really went back to it because I just got busy with other stuff. Like well, on the NSO? No, I just didn't, like, just in general. Oh, alright. Grab him. Then... Nah, that's oh. not a good idea. Okay. How do you keep jumping? Instinct, I don't know. It's so hard. Oh, and the leaf is even showing up. <laughs> yeah. This isn't even a hard level, I'm just sucking. Hey, we know it's your struggle. Would you like some help? No. I mean... We're, okay, how about from Super Kong? Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> DK, you see, bot. Yeah, no. I think the... I think, I, think the, I think one of the funnier examples is Galaxy 2, where Mario literally gets hijacked. <laughs> yeah. Oh, damn it. Frick. Okay, that, that was just, Okay, that one was me forgetting how, uh, where to jump. <laughs> I didn't realize it was, like, immediately. I just like to juggle. Yeah, that, yeah. Uh, remind me of the super relief in this one is it, it's not invincibility. It's just um, a flight. No, no, no. It's invincibility. I'm pretty sure it's a infinite flight. Like you can just fly from like barely even running anything, and you are invincible the entire time. I think it works the same way as the uh, what is it? The um, golden goose. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> um, okay. Uh, so, hold on. Let me just. Not fail this. Go! Oh. Okay. There we go. Okay. Um, yeah, I was saying. Uh, I think it works a si similar way as the Golden Fire Flower, whatever it's called. Where, like, as you cross the finish, the, the, uh, the, uh, flagpole, it just turns into a regular Tanuki leaf. Hmm. Um. But yeah. Oh, it's coming back and forth. Yeah. Oops. Oh gosh. Eh. 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 Yes. Oh. And go. Yep. Go that that thing's I can now. Okay. I did it. I did it. Baby. Now don't suck up. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I thought that was going to be the end. Nope, the map says otherwise. Yeah, I don't always look at that. Who needs a map? Use the map to get through or something, I don't know. Use the boost to get through. Yeah. Yeah, I don't usually look, yeah. like look at maps in general. You most of the time, I kind of just look at the world itself. Like I don't know. Like, I just realized there's a longer world. Uh, not oh. re not really. It's more because I failed. Well, like, well, I mean, because like I don't think any of the worlds so far had fortresses, have they? Um, the first one. It's because we've done special worlds. <laughs> oh. Cause yeah, um, fortresses. I'm, for, I'm pretty sure all the fortresses, fortresses, I can talk, um, have like Resnor as the mini boss, which is is a cool callback at first, but then it just kind of gets like old. When it's the only boss. <laughs> yeah. Turn it. Mm. Yeah. I mean, that's not the best either. Uh, yeah. I don't know why it doesn't funny to see the, the Dry Bones dance. I mean, I'm trying to remember what mid-bosses, like, proper mid-bosses in Mario platformers were like in the 80s and 90s. It wasn't... it wasn't great. <laughs> no, it, it wasn't, no. Um, yeah, I think... Boom Boom and Mario 3 um, is pretty nothing, but... I, 
it it, dev it never really like registers registers in my brain that much because he, he dies in like two seconds anyway. So it's more of just like a, a road bump more than anything. Play the game, then he's then he actually can be kind of threatening when he flies. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's also that, I guess. They well, just, yeah. play the game is don't let him play the game. Pretty much. Um, if you let him play the game, you're doing it wrong. Like I, they try to do, like mix him up a, a bit in like, um, was it Mario U? I think, and I guess 3D Land and World, but it's really not enough. <laughs> Can't really make boom boom a threat. Nah, he's not really designed to be. And he and he's not and he's no goalie either. Yeah. yeah I mean, uh, Pom Mario Strikers joke. I mean, pom pom isn't much better. <laughs> yeah, but pom pom, but pom pom, but pom pom has the is the ninja. That immediately makes her better. Ninjas are cool, but it's still a piss easy boss. <laughs> <laughs> Mid bosses in Mario are just they they're just there. I mean except when they're annoying, like Boom Boom occasionally can be in Mario 3. Yeah. I mean yeah. the thing is with like mid, mid bosses being eh is fine, but uh when you get to 3D land and like Boom Boom and Pom Pom are like actual world bosses, <laughs> I think there's a bit of a I don't know if problem's the right word, but I feel like Oh yeah, them, them together, right? Huh? It's them together, right? Well, some, like, I know at least uh, World Crown They're does that, but, um, the, a lot of the time it's just one of them by themselves as, like, the world boss, and it's just, this is not a great <laughs> way to end a world. Oh, wow. Often they're the actual end bosses. Mm. Good boss. <laughs> I like that they brought these back, these guys back, but like, man. <laughs> I mean, they don't I, do anything as far as I know. Yeah, not really. I mean, I guess to be fair, you can't really do much with Resnor, but still. Maybe, maybe have them spit fireballs. Fireballs, yeah. Mm. Like, maybe mess with the platforms you're on or something? I don't know. Maybe make it spin like ten times faster. We're on world two, Jason. <laughs> that sound that sounds like a rom hack. <laughs> yeah. Maybe make it spin ten times faster. Yeah. I don't know if like Yeah, I don't know if this game actually has like go through walls. That's just something for I presume it's just like for the console Mario console new Mario games. Yeah. Grinning Steve. Yeah, you know. I want to call him Bulosius, but I know he's not. Oh god. Best boss, at, best boss in Luigi's Mansion. Said nobody. <laughs> it's probably one of the more, more interesting ones. It but he's also one of the most annoying. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it does have. Are you aware of how it works in uh, PAL Hidden Mansion? No. Okay, so... I I don't know if this, they do this in the 3DS version, but... Uh, on Only on the PAL version. In the um, US release, it's not like normal the normal fight. Uh, but, yeah, in PAL Hidden Mansion, what happens is that, like, Luigi, like, right... <laughs> this sounds so weird. He rides the vacuum or something, and you kind of, you kind of like weirdly slide around, um, and it makes it, it makes the fight more awkward than it really needs to be. It's so bizarre. I need, a, hold on, let me look it up. Yeah. I'll look at Bulash. I'll look at the 3DS version. Yeah. Because the thing is with the 3DS version as well, the, um, the, I, I don't know how they marketed it, but. The hidden mansion in that game is a. Uh, it, it's literally just pow, uh, like pow hidden mansion. It's not new. <laughs> okay. You said it's only in the hidden mansions version. Yeah.
Fuck's sake. Have you played Luigi's Mansion, uh, Scrappy? No. Really? Huh. It's a go time. Yeah. Yeah, I own remarkably few yeah. first party game games on the GameCube. Oh well. Yeah, I was thinking about this, um, I, I guess I don't know, just kind of moving on to this subject, but, um, I was, I think it was, like, Sylph in a stream at one point, I think it was Rayman, um, where this topic of favourite consoles came out, uh, came up, and I feel like it would def for me it would definitely be between N64, GameCube, and the Switch. I'm leaning heavily towards GameCube because it just has a lot of, um, some of my favourite games, and it just... I, I feel like it just has a lot of, um, interesting... It, it was an interesting period for Nintendo in general, um, and it's definitely... Arguably the, the, um, console I have the most nostalgia for, so... I don't know. Wait, the whole fight is just you riding the uh, on the vacuum? Yes. Even during the main part? What do you mean main part? Even, when, even, during, even during the part where you have to catch the boost? Yeah, the whole fight is when you're, you, you're doing that. It looks super slippery. It is, yeah. Like, like... What? Yeah, I don't know why they did that, it's so bizarre. I can't see what's on the I can't see what's on the 3DS version. So is it just a uh, game? The Let me check. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't. Yeah, I definitely say favorite console is definitely. It's more between the GameCube and the Switch than the N64 because as much as I love that thing, um, it doesn't have the most robust lineup out there. Um, but you know. Uh, which one doesn't have the most robust lineup? N64. I thought you were talking about something else for a moment. Yeah. So like, uh, so I mean, the, fair, but the, the, it's I mean, down to what you like specifically, I guess. Yeah, I mean, I'll say this much. The the games... Also, I thought there was going to be a secret exit there, but there just kind of wasn't, unless I missed it. Um, yeah, no, I... The, the games that I do like on the, on the N64, I do really like. Like, Banjo-Tooie, for example, is like favorite game of all time so you know <laughs> but that's also not the best way to play that game but still um, yeah do you guys have like a favorite console have you like thought about that at all before uh goodness gracious I'm I think I just go with the flow, honestly. It's like, whatever I can play... Whatever I can play my Nintendo games on. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Like, probably the Wii. Cause that's when I probably played stuff the most. Yeah. Mm, that's fair. I think it had a pretty... I think it had a pretty decent library in its own right when... Yeah. By the, by the end of the day. Yeah. Like, um... I mean, for what little, however little I played it, because I was in college and oh. just going through stuff at a time, I, I enjoyed my Wii a fair deal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Wii, I definitely have a lot of memories of the Wii. Um, like N64, GameCube, and Wii was like the time period where I actually got to play uh, games with like my family and whatnot, and that just like starting with the Wii U, or like not starting with it, but like. Um, a little bit after the Wii U came out was where that kind of just stopped happening because growing up it's scary kids. <laughs> That's about <laughs> the best way I can put it. Like just people moving out, um, growing up, all this other stuff and you can't, so a lot of the stuff you, you could do as a kid you can't really do as much like as an adult. So yeah. <laughs> Um, those three generations I have a lot of uh, memories for, just for, like, that stuff, um, but yeah.
I do remember like when the Wii first came out, uh, you literally couldn't uh, play it without like someone wanting to play with you. It was a, an interesting time to say the least. And I kind of just missed two coins there. That was good. What was I going to say? <sighs> yeah, um, like I... Uh... I, I was still looking for- I can't- I, don't, I can't find the Google Launch as 3DS, so I'm just gonna assume no. Mm. I have no interest in playing the 3DS version, so... Hey, have you seen how that game looks like you tried doing two-player? Isn't it like... a cl clip show? Or something? <laughs> you, let's just, let, I, from what I've seen, it makes Adabat look functional. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, it may- it, it's gonna make, uh, Unleashed HD on PS3 blush. <laughs> like I said, it makes Adabat look functional. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, my friends need me soonish. Yeah. We should be done soon. Um. Yeah. Uh, what were you um, saying? I enjoyed the PlayStation Three a lot. I mean, some of that was yeah. down to the ubiquity of the PS One classics, but I mean, the actual. New stuff was uh, was pretty enjoyable, and it helps me expand my palettes ever so slightly. So that's nice. Yeah. For... yeah. That's why I played Rayman Origins. No, I played Rayman Origins. Rayman Origins on the Wii because Wii games were cheaper. Remember that? <laughs> and that was interesting how times change. Like... Gosh, bring back non-HD games. <laughs> yeah. We don't have. For... Back to pixels. Yeah, back to pixels. So is there one here? Oh. Okay, what, what the heck Wait. am I missing? <clears throat> well, alright, I'm looking it up. We're all two for. It's up there. Not good. By the power of very game exp mm. Mm. Uh, Yeah, because this is the first one. Okay, so... Let's see. What, what, what? Sucking, so... <laughs> oh, stock one. Oh, wait, what? I see a thing up there, see... but... Go back into that pipe. Oh. Back on the ground. Straight from Let the me see. Yeah, down there. Is it like that block? Wait, what? It's right. Up. Hold right. Oh. Hold on. I see. Okay. Oh, that's just. That's like some Donkey Kong Country 2 style of hiding stuff. Yeah, right? Yeah. I, I... Oh. Yeah, that, that is clever, I'll give him that, because, like, those kinds of blocks you can go through. I didn't... That didn't really register to me, like... God. It's very subtle, things like that. Yeah. Also, no, I am totally not rushing just so I can play Fortnite. <laughs> I mean, I, I need... I want to rush because I want to sleep. Um, Harry and froze again. Harry. Frozen. I, I see that. You know what, screw it. I'm just gonna stop it here. I don't care. Um, <laughs> I, I'm not fixing this to do, like, a few more levels. I, I just, I need sleep. Did the, did, did the recording freeze too? Yeah, I see, like, Mario's just kind of grabbing coins. <laughs> okay, what I'm gonna do is, um, go, do a quick save. So, yeah, when we get back, we'll just, um... The, the, the uh, this next recording. episode of Harry tries to find a better 3DS recording. Oh god. I mean it did it, it didn't do any it didn't do this for an hour, so I mean I guess we can work with this, but it's still a pain. Alright. Um, I will I'll re re reiterate, we are not gonna do that many 3DS LPs because screw working with this garbage. Um Yeah. See you guys next time. This is stupid. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> I'm stuck in limbo, help! <laughs> <laughs>